Hey everybody, Kyle here. Have you ever wondered why art is so incredibly expensive? Uh, I mean, I'm not talking about like, you know, the big art stars whose stuff sells for like a hundred million dollars. I mean, if you go into a gallery and find an emerging artist and you see a thousand dollars for something you've never heard of and you're like, well, how can they possibly justify spending that much money? You know, why, why is it that expensive? Why isn't it only $50 like that poster I found at Sprawl Mart is? Well, I'd like to give an example, one very specific example, of what I'm working on now. So, here's a little sneak peek of my next painting. Um, it's a little, you know, 6x6 six six image on an 8x8 eight eight frame, and I'm thinking of selling this for $200. Now, you might be thinking, that's, that's kind of a lot for just a tiny little simple monochrome image in a dinky little frame, piece of paper, cost me five bucks. I get 12 squares out of that one sheet, so that works out to, say, 40 cents. The map board that's behind it is going to be $12 tax. The frame costs $16 plus tax. Also, the image on this one is laser cut. Commercial rates on a laser typically are about two dollars a minute. An image this size takes me 17 minutes to engrave. It cost me $67 to make one of these. Now keep in mind I'm going to be selling them at a gallery and galleries charge a commission. What's the commission? On average 50 percent. So that means this thing I have to sell for $134.43 just to break even. That's not making any profit. $134 is the point at which I don't lose money on the sale. The supplies themselves aren't the only costs. My knife costs $10. My cutting mat is another $50. Ruler, six bucks. Studio cut works out to being about $440 a month. That's a recurring cost. I'm not gonna do the math on all these little things, but that's all built into everything I produce. That $134.40 figure that I gave you is assuming that at the show I have a 100% success rate. If I sold it for $134, absolutely every single piece in the show would have to sell for me to break even. If even one piece doesn't sell, I lost money. And a sellout is an incredibly rare newsworthy event when it occurs. I have to charge $200 to have a fair chance of really breaking even and maybe walking away with a couple of bucks. If you're ever wondering like, why is this so damn expensive? It's because it costs a lot to make. And, you know, as a highly educated person who has a degree, I would challenge you to find one other field where skilled professionals are looked down upon for trying to eke by on minimum wage for their labor.